Okay, so Dave and I put some targets way the out there. Let's see if I can find them. Should be able to find them here if the trees aren't in my way. Oh yeah, there it is, starting to come in. So we got should have two targets. Kind of rinky-dink makeshift targets, but there they are. Now we're gonna have to figure range and find our our uh, clicks and figure this out. But anyway, that's that gives you a rough idea how far out that mother is. And uh, I'll shoot another piece of video here when I've figured out our range. We're getting a little wind kicking up. The first bunch of shots we took, we had perfect conditions, but now we're getting a little bit of a wind in our face. Over okay, we're out here at 1,273 according to my um, range finder on the scope there. It's about one between 1.8 and 1.9, not quite 2 MOA from the top of the target to the black horizontal line is 24 inches. So about 1.8, it was 2 MOA was just a smidge below the black line. So I'm calling it 1.8 MOA at this distance, which comes out to 1,273 yards. So to give you an idea of uh, how far off we were shooting and versus aiming, uh, that's about 6 MOA low, and it's about 5 MOA right. So the bullets were all hitting right behind the lower one. Uh, you know, if, the, if you shot straight through that target and hit the ground behind it, and uh, that target was on the right before of the two targets up by the tree. So, uh, by the time you get out to 1200 yards, it's real hard to use the uh, tick marks on the scope to uh, figure your distance, which I thought it was about 1.8 MOA for my distance measurement, but uh, apparently the 1.8 MOA is more like the lower right target, and the back one's probably more like 1.7 MOA or something. <clears throat> and I uh, had to crank a little windy gin. I don't know if I even hit the target on the next five shots, but what I did then is I put the crosshairs pretty much at the top edge of the upper left target, put the vertical on the lower target, which was right at 6 MOA low, and I uh, shot off five more rounds. And uh, DL, he's driving out there to uh, pick up both targets, bring them back, and to see if any holes went in the lower right uh, target board at all. So we'll see what happens when he gets back with that.